Art on the Square returns to Belleville this weekend. Fox News' Jamie Travers gives us a preview of the three day long event. Artists from all over the nation have congregated here in Belleville for Art on the Square. They spent the afternoon getting ready for the big opening night and outside of the threat of some storms tonight, the rest of the weekend is looking perfect for visitors. This event traditionally takes place the weekend after Mother's Day and has been going strong since 2002. And it's not just local artists. It features original work from over 100 accomplished artists from over 30 states. This year, there are over 50 new artists, which keeps the show fresh. And this isn't just an event for art. It'll also feature entertainment as well as food and drinks from local restaurants, making it fun for not only your eyes, but also your ears and palate as well. Organizers and artists alike are excited for what's going to be a busy and fun weekend. Most of the artists, they find the show because we are nationally ranked. I think we were ranked ninth last year in the country. And um, they hear about us from other artists. We really like to take care of our artists when they're here. And the, the town comes out for them and they do great. They have good sales and everybody has a great time. This year I just decided to do something different. And, um, and I've heard great reviews about this show, so I decided to apply and I got accepted and they asked me to be the poster artist this year, so that was a bonus. People tend to gravitate towards the work because it's universal, you know, and it tells stories that, um, you know, that we weren't taught in school. So it's, it's a little bit of history in my work and uh, inspiration. This event is free and of course it is family friendly. They have an extensive interactive children's art garden. They have face painting and kids can also make their own art to take home with them. Reporting in Belleville, I'm meteorologist Jamie Travers.